So go ahead and sit in a comfortable seated position. Have a moment to shift your way forward. So you're feeling the weight reaching into your feet in the front of the pelvis. And shift the weight back so you're feeling the weight more into the lower back, into the coccyx and the tailbone. And find the middle point in between these two edges. Just place the right hand on the belly, left hand on the heart. Take a few deep breaths, feeling the breath moving into your hands, so you're meeting yourself from your inner body. Feeling the waves of the breath reaching the bottom hand, expanding into the top hand. As you're doing so, slightly close your eyes. So allow your eyes to rest into their socket. So you can be a little bit more into the internal space of the brain. Bringing this sense and feeling of peace and calm. Shifting the weight of your hands now into the side of the body, around the belly, around the waistline. Take a deep inhale, feeling through the breath, lengthening both sides of the upper body as even as possible. And as you do so, move your hands into the bottom of the rib cage and the back of your body. Keep expanding your breath into those points of contact of your hands and the upper body. reaching the area of the kidneys. If you're feeling balloons full of energy with your inhale, expanding the area of the kidneys and lower back. And on the exhale, allow this energy to return into the center of your body, referring to the spine. A couple more deep breaths. Keep directing your awareness to the space of your kidneys. And on the next exhale, transition into all four hands and knees. Make sure that your hands are in a 90 degree angle below your shoulders. Your knees can be slightly behind the hips line. You can lengthen through the side of your body. Soften your eyes, take a deep breath. Cat cow, take a deep inhale, arch, opening the front of the body. Take a deep exhale, tuck the ribs in, now opening the back of the body. Take a few of these ones on the inhale, opening, softening the belly and opening the chest, the sternum, collarbones. On the exhale, so create a gentle push of your hands into the earth, tuck the ribs in, open the back of the body. One more time, take a deep inhale, and a deep exhale. Shift the way back into a wide knees chai pose, allowing your sit bones to rest into your feet. Walk your fingertips and hands slightly forward, feeling a length through the sides of the body. Go ahead and take a deep breath, expanding the breath into the belly, into the chest, potentially into the back of the body. On 
the next inhale run yourself forward lower down lay on your chest on the ground inhale into a cobra shoulders back and down elbows in shift the weight back again into chai pose couple of times more series of three rounds inhale forward exhale lower down shoulders back and down take a deep inhale lengthen through the spine all the way into the crown exhale shift the weight back into chai pose one more time on your own take a deep inhale and take a deep exhale Tuck your toes on the earth and step back into a downward facing dog. Find all surface of your hand in contact with the earth. Thumbs pointing towards each other, middle fingers point forward, pinky finger points to the side. Bring the heels up, slightly bend the knees as you push the hands into the earth, extend through the side of the body elbow reach up and back away from the hands on the next exhale allow your shoulders to sink into their socket to the cavities creating a length on the collarbones lengthen through the neck up into your crown on the next exhale push through the back of the sit bones into the heels heels into the earth if you have lower back pain, any sensitivities with the lower back in general, just keep the knees bent during the whole downward dog pose. Take a deep inhale, lift the right leg up behind you. On the exhale, run yourself forward, knee to nose. Inhale, extend the leg up behind you. Exhale, round forward, knee to nose. Inhale one more time, extending through the sides of the body. Exhale, step the right foot forward in between the hands. Come into a high lunge. Take a deep inhale, rising hands up into the sky. Exhale, hands into the heart center. Inhale, open into cactus arms, shoulders, scapulas, into the back of the heart, heart forward. Exhale, round, tuck the ribs in, hands in prayer, heart center. Two more times, take a deep inhale, open. Take a deep exhale, round. One more time, take a deep inhale. Exhale, find the hands down into the earth. Inhale, plank. Exhale, lower down into Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Left leg up into the sky behind you. Take a deep inhale. Exhale, round forward, knee to nose. Two more times, take a deep inhale, lengthening through the sides of the body. Exhale, as you round, navel into the spine, connecting into the space of the kidneys. Inhale, lengthen, you push in the air behind you. On the exhale, round, tuck. One more time, take a deep inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step the foot forward in between the hands. Press the feet into the earth. Take that strength coming from the earth to come up into a high lunge. Inhale. Exhale, find the hands into the heart center. Cactus arms, take a deep inhale. Scapulas into the back of the heart. Softening the muscles on your back. Exhale, round, tuck the ribs in creating freedom and space through the middle back inhale exhale 
One more time, take a deep inhale, full of prana, life force. Exhale, find the hands down into the earth. Shift the weight back into a plank. On the exhale, tuck the ribs in, keep yourself in that shape for one more breath. Inhale into the back of the body. Exhale, lower down into a Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Downward dog waves, bring the heels up. Inhale, round the body forward. In the exhale, micro bend the knees, gentle arch the back, shift the way back. At the end of the movement, find the heels down. Heels touch the earth, heels up, round the body forward, shoulders in line with hands. On the exhale, gentle micro bend the knees, shift the way back into an arch. Heels down, heels up, inhale, round forward. Exhale, arch and shift the way back. And the next one, step the feet forward using the momentum. Standing forward bend on the exhale, bow forward. Inhale, lift halfway. Exhale, bow. Again, if you have any sensitivities on your lower back, sciatica, tight hamstrings, make sure to keep your knees slightly bent. Two more times, inhale, lengthen halfway, every segment of the spine is being length up into the crown. Exhale, bow forward. Keep your eyes soft, inhale, initiate the movement with the breath, lengthen halfway. Exhale, bow. Press the feet down into the earth, inhale all the way up into the sky. Exhale, hands into the heart center. Inhale, hands up through the center axis of your body, referring to the spine. Exhale, hands by the side, creating a circle of bees. Bend the elbows, meet your hands into the heart space. Take a deep inhale. Come into the energetics of the practice. Close your eyes, circle your hands around you, creating a circle of peace. Bend the elbows, hands meet into the solar plexus. One more time, inhale all the way up. And on the exhale, bow forward, close the circle all the way down, hands into the earth. Three times, lift halfway, take a deep inhale, tailbone reach back, crown of the head, lengthen forward. Exhale, bow. Inhale, lengthen. You can touch base with your belly, with your chest, as well as with the lower back when you exhale. Creating more awareness on the inside. Take a deep inhale one more time. Lengthen halfway. Crown, lengthen forward to the infinite space in front of you. Exhale, bow into the earth. Look forward, step the feet back into a plank Chaturanga Dandasana. Continue the Vinyasa flow, lower down. Inhale, take a deep inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Left leg up into the sky. Knee to nose, round forward on the exhale. Inhale, open, exhale, round. Couple more of these ones. Moving the energy around any stagnation on your middle back and lower back. And the next one, find the left foot down forward in between the hands. Take a deep inhale into a high lunge, rising up from the earth into the sky. Exhale, hands into the heart space. Arch, take a deep inhale, cactus arms. Exhale, round, gathering the energy into your heart center. Inhale, with the arch, scapula, touch the back of the heart. Exhale, round, tuck the ribs in. One more time, take a deep inhale. 
open chest forward for life and on the exhale round hands down into the floor we take a vinyasa inhale plank exhale shatranga tandasana initiate the movement with the breath inhale up exhale back right leg up into the sky right foot forward in between the hands turn your back foot flat come up into a warrior two make sure your hips are right in the middle between the front and the back foot grounding the other edge of the back foot take a deep inhale press the feet into the earth strengthen the legs lifting up from from the pelvic floor all the way into the crown on the exhale sinking into warrior two find your hands in the back of your body where the interface of your rib cage and your kidneys meet take a deep breath into that space moving your awareness where your hands has been placed keeping your eyes halfway open halfway close you keep yourself internally release the hands come back into a warrior two transition from here back hand touch the back leg from hand reach up into the sky reverse warrior the next exhale car wheel the hands down into the floor inhale plank exhale shatranga tandasana inhale up dog lengthening through the spine into the crown exhale downward facing dog push your hands down hips up and back heels down into the floor we take three breath in stillness and downward dog or three breath in motion downward dog waves left leg up into the sky left foot forward in between the hands back foot flat grounding the other edge of the back foot press the feet down come up into a warrior to carry the hands up find the hands in line with your shoulders sinking down from the hips keeping the front knee in a 90 degree angle alignment above the ankle Dispose developing strength, inner strength, warrior two, embracing the qualities of the peaceful warrior, humble, generous, ready to protect truth, your inner truth. Reverse warrior, find the back hand reach into the back leg, reach the front hand up into the sky. Exhale, car wheel the hands down into the floor. Take a vinyasa plank on the inhale. Chaturanga Dandasana on the exhale. Press the hands down, grow through the spine into an up dog. Turn your toes, shift the way up and back, heels down, downward facing dog. right leg up into the sky push the air behind you lengthening through both sides of your waist and your torso as even as possible round knee to nose and step the foot forward in between hands come up into a high lunge hands into the heart center shift the way forward float into the space warrior three find the hands behind you option to keep the hands on the hips or interlace the fingers opening the heart taking a deep breath energizing the bottom leg and the back leg on the exhale keep lengthening and growing through every segment of the spine expansion of awareness from the inside out take a deep inhale and exhale release and find the right hand down into the floor your upper body is facing sideways keep the back foot flex into a half moon five energy lines moving through this pose the bottom leg 
through the back leg to the bottom arm, top arm and through the spine. Full participation of your body, expanding the energy from the kidneys, which is our chi container, a container of our life force, pulsing through the whole body. The breath is a vehicle to allow this energy to move consciously through our whole body. Take a deep inhale. Exhale, find the top hand down into the floor. Land softly into a lunge. Downward facing dog, right leg up into the sky, open the hip, bend the knee, expand your breath into the right side of the body, creating a gentle massage into the right lung, into the liver, organ awareness. For more vitality, releasing any stagnation on our organs. Close the hip, leg up into the sky. Downward facing dog with an option if you feel comfortable to move forward and take a vinyasa plank chaturanga dandasana inhale all the way up exhale all the way back left leg up into the sky in motion open the hip bend the knee take a deep breath couple of deep breath into the left side of the body nurturing the left side of your lungs stomach spleen Pancreas. Most of the tensions in our bodies are a reflection of the tightness and the tension that we're holding in our organs. Stretch the leg up into the sky. Downward facing dog. One more time, take the leg up into the sky. Foot four in between the hand. Come up into a high lunge. Take a deep inhale. Exhale, gathering the energy into your heart space. Take a momentum. Inhale, float forward. Come into a warrior three, bit of a drasana three. Same arm variation. Full participation for activation in the body. Keep moving the breath. Inhale and exhale. Half moon, shifting the weight to the side. Five energy lines on this pose. Bottom leg, back leg, bottom arm, top arm, and through the spine. Reaching and expanding every segment of the spine into the crown. Shoulders soft, inner smile, peaceful vibration. On the next exhale, find the top hand down into the floor, square the hips, lunge, take a vinyasa. Move with the breath, initiate every movement with the breath. Breath has the uplifting force. Breath as the vehicle of transmission of your intention, peace, and calm, and serenity through the whole body. From downward facing dog, you're gonna move forward into a plank position. You're gonna lower down very slow into Chaturanga in four, three, two, one, and zero melting into the earth stretching the arms forward rolling into the side of the body then you lay on your back and I come into a happy baby finding knees into the chest first then find the feet right above the knees you can keep your hands on the outside holding the soles of the feet another option could be from the inner lines of the feet on the arches as much as possible keep yourself grounding your lower back your sacrum breath awareness into the back of the body that space 
of your back that is in full contact with the earth. Visualizing your kidneys floating on the space. Visualizing your kidneys moving in this eternal expansion and contraction that constantly happening through the breath. Our muscles respond in the same way, extending and contracting. Our fascia connective tissue system opens up and closes in the same way. Even when we are in stillness, there is a whole universe inside of us in constant movement. Find knees to the chest. Stretch the feet overhead. Finding the feet above the head, toes, toes touching the ground. From knees together, stretch the legs overhead, toes touch the ground. You can slide your way to the side to roll the shoulders back even more. Keeping a nice presence of the back of the shoulders and back of the arms into the earth. That would be the support with your hands into your lower back or kidneys to help yourself to reach the earth. Not necessarily this needs to happen. You can also keep the stretch halfway through by keeping the knees slightly bent. Breath awareness. Move your inner side, your inner eyes into that point of contact between your hands and the skin of your back. You can say on this pose, on micro bend the knees to find the knees by the ears. You take three more deep breaths. Slowly, slowly, one vertebrae at a time. You're gonna start placing upper back into the ground, middle back into the ground, and upper back into the ground. Keep the knee chest, find the hands by the side, final twist, find their legs together towards the right side. Join me on this visualization as you move your awareness into the spine. You visualize that twist as an open spiral that is moving from the bottom of the spine, circling around your spine, all the way to the crown, especially through the upper body, moving from the left kidney into the right shoulder and spiraling from left to back, traveling through your whole body and with every place that you move internally, your awareness, there's an opportunity to length, to find internal space for your breath move more natural, for unlocking any hidden tensions Take a deep inhale back to center and exhale twist to the other side. Give yourself at least one or two breaths when you land on the twist for your body to connect with the pose. You're feeling the inner yes bubbling up to the surface to open or expand the twist. Close your eyes and take a few deep breaths. Visualizing the breath moving now from the right side of your back into the left in the front of your body. It's spiraling through the spine, around the spine. Reaching from the kidneys, 
from that powerful organs that keep us in full vitality into the heart into the throat into the space of the back of the eyes the space of the eyes all the way into the crown nourishing yourself completely with inner peace with calm with presence inhale exhale return back to center stretch the legs down find your shoulder your feet more than shoulder width apart toes pointing out heels in palms face up and turn into one moment of shavasana the final pose Take a deep breath and feeling the wave of relaxation moving through your whole body. This energy coming from your kidneys spreading like a drop of water, landing on a peaceful lake, create waves of expansion. Expand with an inner smile, joy into your body peace into your life grace inside and around you Take a few moments on this final relaxation pose. Recommendation to have a song or music that you feel really connected that bring you peace that bring you back home inside of you you can keep this shavasana for five minutes ten minutes and at the end waking up toes and fingers return yourself into your body bend the knees and lay on the side Coming back into a seated cross leg position. Finding our hands into the heart center. Bowing the head forward into the palms. Bowing to the greatest teacher of all. Gratitude for life and for this practice as a, as a tool to help us restore our natural flow of energy inside. Thank you for your privilege. Namaste.